welcome back to my channel guys <laughs> i'm here for my doctor's appointment guys <sighs> you need to see how i'm just how i was just rushing you know <laughs> see the one i'm breathing with this mask guys it's not easy <laughs> it's not easy at all and uh, right now um i came a little bit early so there is nobody here i can't see anyone i know they've come for um their break because they don't joke with their break it's just um past one and they usually go to break by 12 to resume by um two so i have to sit and wait my son also has um his own appointment today so my husband just dropped me and then went with him for his own appointment his own appointment is two o'clock one mine is two thirty that's why we i came early so i have to sit down and wait so while i wait let me show you guys what my bum looks like right now i'm in my second trimester but last stage of my second trimester because i'll soon end that third trimester yeah it has not really been easy guys it has not been easy <laughs> honestly <laughs> let me not say this is the toughest stage because it's actually the toughest stage it's not the toughest stage i don't think because my first trimester was hell it was something else but this pregnancy have not been easy although um, it's not like my first pregnancy <sighs> this one is totally different I think this one is more stressful in my um, second trimester yeah it's more difficult in this my second trimester compared to my my first pregnancy my first pregnancy my first trimester was hell but second trimester was a little bit easier like this pregnancy now i still vomit in the morning while brushing you know and right now uh, there is nothing i eat that i get to enjoy the taste or something how do i even put it my mouth is always bitter you know and um i'm always feeling so weak you know always breathing fast <laughs> always tired even talking self <sighs> even talking just to talk i'll just be breathing so, so heavily you know <laughs> honestly this one is so tough so so tough i don't enjoy my food and i still don't have appetite for most foods you know so i just eat most times for eating sake i eat without enjoying the food without enjoying what i'm eating so sometimes it's just to eat for eating sake you know just to fill my stomach and all that and now i noticed with this pregnancy i added a lot of weight unlike my first pregnancy my first pregnancy i didn't add weight rather i lost a lot of weight but in this pregnancy i added weight you know i really added you know so there are just <laughs> so many differences you know it's not easy oh it's not easy guys <laughs> yeah it's not easy about another thing i noticed i noticed that this my baby <laughs> is very active i don't know if it's because i've experienced pregnancy the first time this is my second experience because i feel his movement every now and then i feel the as in, he's too active <laughs> he's too active honestly i always feel his movement even from my from my 13 weeks i've started feeling his movement you know maybe because this is my second experience i don't know maybe <laughs> so 
just yeah updating you guys <laughs> updating you guys you know my journey is so far being pregnant you can even notice from my face i really added weight now i'm, I'm weighing almost the last time i came for my appointment i weighed 90 something <sighs> today i don't know what i weigh <laughs> Maybe I will even go up to 100. Don't worry, guys. I'll keep you all updated after my checkup. You know? That's one good thing about here. Once you're pregnant, you'll be coming for appointment every month. They'll be checking you every single month. You know? And also running several tests, series of tests on you. But because of this um, coronavirus thing, um, they've not been running the test like my first pregnancy this journey is not easy all my clothes hardly enter me this time around as you can see this is my jacket can you see you can't even zip up because of my stomach if you see my tummy you think I'll, I'll be giving birth to door tomorrow but I still have like two months more to go yeah let me just say uh, I have roughly three months more to go. So it's not like <laughs> I'm giving birth to door tomorrow. I still have a long way to go. But then <laughs> looking at me, you would think this baby is coming out today, not tomorrow. <laughs> oh my god. It's not easy. It's really tiring and challenging and all through this pregnancy I've been really going through hard times, honestly hard times i've been just down you know emotionally down drained i just pray that god will see me through and help me to deliver my baby without any complication deliver my baby with ease without any problem um <laughs> Trying to stand up from the bed is like something else. <laughs> it's something else. Even sometimes when I'm sleeping, I don't just uh, know the perfect um, position to stay. You know, I'll just be rolling on the bed trying to get a, a good, a comfortable position for me to sleep. You know, it's not easy. It's not easy. And coupled with the fact that I still have a toddler to take care of, you know. It made it so hectic. I don't know if that also added with my emotional breakdown this time. Yeah, because all through this pregnancy, it has been it has been a very down moment for me. Honestly, it's so stressful. Unlike my first um, pregnancy, I was getting all the care, you know, <laughs> and then. I have no one to take care of, you know. It's just me. I decide when to wake up, when to eat and all that, you know. But with a toddler, guys, it's not easy at all. It's really stressful. It's really stressful. Coupled with the fact that my toddler is still, he's still like a baby. <laughs> he's not even up to a year and six months. You get? So he's just like a baby. Another me and i'm having another baby you know so it's so stressful for me being that i'm here without anybody to help me no help nothing it has not really been easy for me guys honestly i have to say this this pregnancy is really a struggle i can't wait for me to just finally give birth you know and have my body back, have myself back, and then do something about my weight because guys, you have here really added weight. So, Let's see what my bum looks like. I cannot, can you see that guys? It cannot zip up again. 
it can't. <laughs> it really added though. Honestly. So guys, I'll catch you guys when I'm done. I'll catch you guys when I'm done with my midwife. Yeah. Okay, and then I'll update you guys how everything went, you know. Yeah, so so guys I'm done <laughs> I'm done with my appointment some and we see my doctor guys <laughs> I really added I really added weight honestly under one month I added five kg as an extra five kg guys <sighs> and now <laughs> you know here yeah, they don't just take chances they placed me on a diet now they gave me a list of food to be eating and the ones I shouldn't eat they said it's um, too risky for me because I've really added I'm weighing 99.5 so almost 100 kg guys so they said from the beginning of my pregnancy till now that I've added like 9 kg but under one month I added 5 kg guys I don't know I don't usually eat in the morning I really don't eat in the morning I don't just understand why I'm adding I can't tell why I'm adding with this way because I don't eat in the morning I think the problem is because I don't exercise because after eating I still have to sit at home without any exercise you know so I think that's the major problem I think that's the major problem and they said I should try and be taking a walk at least 30 minutes walk every day mm, that is where I really need to step up because to be honest <laughs> I'm too lazy to take a walk I'm always too lazy to take a walk I will admit that but these days I, would, I just have to discipline myself I have to sit up and then you know charm, and then try to you know fix a time a particular time that i'll be going out although it's winter the weather is cold but guys i i have to do this for myself honestly i have to do this they place me on a diet on <laughs> oh my god it's not really gonna be easy but i have to do it for my own good i really have to do it for my own good guys so that is all <laughs> uh, for today you know I just want to you know carry you guys along and oh, I just want to update you guys so guys that's all thank you guys for watching thank you so much for watching um and feel free to share my video like comment and join the family subscribe to my channel if you haven't bye and see you all in my next video Bye-bye. <laughs>